Welcome to Today's Issues, a community service program informing you of the issues and events in the four state area. Now, here are the issues for today on KNEO 91.7 FM. Good morning, this is Luke Taylor with a Capitol Report update. State Representative Ben Baker is with us to discuss the House's crime bills that are being moved forward. We'll let him tell you about that now. So we had another busy week in Jefferson City this week, a lot of legislation beginning to move through the process. One of the bills we third read this week and sent to the Senate was the crime bill package. As you know, crime in the cities is really out of control, especially St. Louis and Kansas City. And unfortunately, there's a trend of juveniles being involved, partially because of how the law is structured. Uh, And there are, uh, of course, other factors as well. But the crime bill has multiple parts to the language, but overall deals with public safety, gives a little more teeth to the law for prosecutors when a juvenile is being tried for serious crimes, like murder, and allows them to be tried as adults if certain criteria is met. Uh, It also modifies the definition of persistent offenders to include someone who has been previously found guilty of a dangerous felony, Um, It repeals the exclusion of the offense of armed criminal action, makes it an unclassified felony. Uh, It also creates a task force for cyber stalking and harassment, which are crimes that um, has had a major uptick in recent years. Adds to the endangering of the welfare of a child statute, where in case uh, someone is encouraging a minor to be involved in crimes where the conduct involved weapons offenses and makes that a felony as well. It also includes Blair's Law regarding celebratory gunfire, making that illegal in cities, uh, and changes the penalty from a misdemeanor to a felony for assault of a police animal. There are several other parts to that, but that's the main provisions of the crime bill. And then last of all, IP reform. The Senate did perfect a bill this week on initiative petition reform, but uh, unfortunately, the compromise position removed, I believe, some very important parts of the bill that were ensuring that illegal aliens cannot vote and protect, protecting against foreign meddling of elections. So I suspect that the House will try to put that language back in, but we'll see uh, what happens moving forward. I think the, the people of Missouri want to tighten up our election process and would be in favor of those provisions. So uh, with that, that'll be a wrap for this week, and we'll catch you next week. 160th District State Representative Ben Baker can be reached at his Jefferson City office at 573-751-9781. And we'll also mention that we're making the Capitol Report update available as a podcast now. Find it wherever you get your podcasts and get each day's update from our local legislators by searching for KNEO Capitol Report. This has been today's issues. For more information about the issues you've just heard, call 417-451-5636. Today's Issues is presented as a public service of KNEO, 91.7 FM, a sky-high radio network. If you live within the broadcast area of KNEO Radio, we have a podcast just for you. The KNEO Community Connection keeps your finger on the pulse of what's coming up in the four-state area telling you about upcoming events you don't want to miss, organizations in our communities doing great work, and conversations with the dynamic citizens who are behind it all. There's a lot going on around you that you don't want to miss. This is Luke Taylor. Join me each week as we talk about what's happening with the people who are making it happen. Brought to you by KNEO Radio 91.7 FM and the Sky High Podcast Network. Subscribe today wherever you get your podcasts.